So from your Thinkific dashboard, you are going to go down to support your students and down to users. Then you're simply going to click on new user. From here, you're going to enter their first name, their last name. These, uh, these two are custom fields that I've put in here. So any custom fields you have and their email address. Now you're going to choose whether you want them to manually set their own password on your Thinkific site or, um, or whether you're going to choose one for them. So you're going to set that here. Once you do that, you're going to decide whether you want to send the site welcome email if you have that set up and that would be under notifications. And then uh, if you're setting them up as a course participant, you won't need any of these user roles here. Then you're going to enroll your user in a particular course and set an expiry date if you only want them to have access to it for a period of time. Click Enroll. You should see the product that they're enrolled in or the digital product and the expiry date here. You can add them to any groups you have set up and then you simply click Save Changes. So again, before you add any users, make sure you have your notifications set up properly so that they will get an email when they enroll. Or alternatively, you might have this hooked into your email marketing service provider like MailChimp or ConvertKit. Again, you want that set up so that when they enroll in a course, they're going to get the welcome email.